Hey guys, me again. I'm sure uh, you're loving seeing my face at the moment. Anyway, uh, I've been told I'm not a very good patriot, so uh, I've also been told what I should do to be a good patriot is to deregister to vote. Now, this seems to be a thing that happens quite a bit, and I know quite a few people that have deregistered, but uh, there's one set of people out there who aren't deregistering. Now, I'm presuming our Patriot friends won't know who they are, but I'll tell you now, they're called party voters, they're called Fianna Fáil voters, Fianna Gael voters, Labour voters, Green voters, whatever. You deregistering and calling me pro-government is ironic because you deregistering makes their vote stronger so when I'm out voting against them and you're deregistered sitting down complaining calling me pro-government when you haven't even voted you're a bit more pro-government than I am because you just wasted your vote that someone died for so you know uh you're also running around with your little riot squads or whatever um saying that you're going to take the power back you're gonna you're fighting for freedom you're fighting for this that the other you see here's the thing you're not you know you're not and I'd like to think you're smart enough to know you're not because I think all you want is trouble because you know the government aren't afraid of you now you running up and down Molesworth Street kicking the shit out of women uh, running around after Gemma kicking the shit out of women uh, and everything else like that that the government are laughing at you. The government don't fear you. Shoot. Why would they? What do you do? Real patriots were in the GPO. The ones that got you where you are. The ones that got you your votes. The ones that got me my vote. That I actually use. And you're... Oh, we're going to take back this. We're taking the power back. Blah, blah, blah. You're not doing shit. The likes of Leo, he's looking out his doll window, sneering at you all, having a good laugh. Because all you're doing is running up and down the road with the guard to protect, with the guard to protecting you. Uh, this, that, the other, and you think you're doing great stuff. You're doing nothing. You're not doing a thing. All you're doing is making a fool out of yourselves. Making a fool out of people who probably are trying to do something on the right and everything else. So when all the rest of the country are looking this way, are you making fools of yourselves? How do you expect this to take you seriously? We have a centre-right government. And you're over there acting the bollocks. I mean, of course they're laughing at you. See? Also, actually, now, come to think of it, you have this running gig of uh, anyone who doesn't see your view these days, whatever about the Antifa thing, I don't give a shit about that because you're so brain dead you don't even realise what's going on there. I mean, I'm sick to the back teeth of telling you, or I've been arguing with you about that. But you have this new thing now of people that don't agree with you. Uh, we're all paedophiles, apparently, paedophile protectors. Now, there is a certain religion that do the exact same thing that's based in Middle Abbey Street. They're called Scientologists. Now, with the amount of nationalist patriots going around calling people pedos it makes me wonder if Scientology actually have a sale on the courses 
uh, because they do the exact same thing. So, you know, you're obviously getting, you know, you're obviously not the good Catholics that the, the state raised. Yeah. But, uh, and another thing, while you're out calling us pedos and then talking up the Catholic Church, just remember what that country has done to, what that religion has done to this country. They've stripped the rights of every woman in this country since 1922 right up to the 80s when they decided we had fucking enough you know the what you need to remember is the uh the woman you bet the shit out of today is the reason that the lgbt community are where they are in ireland we should look into that maybe uh but I doubt you will, because uh, if it ain't in a picture, you ain't going to read. Um, so yeah, so while you're out there uh, protecting pedophiles, like you say we are, and deflecting your own ideologies, in a way, onto us, just remember, that's another reason that uh, no one takes you seriously. Okay? You know, the nuns in tune, they didn't kill any babies according to Gemma and the anti-corruption. And uh, the leader of the, the IFP going around writing books saying that the uh, the whole sex abuse deal with the, the, the church was just a setup for quick money. Yeah. Talk to anyone in the Madeline laundries about a quick setup for a quick buck. See how far you get. Yeah. There's a reason the church or the government uh, locked away all those files for 75 years. Do you know why that is? Because by the time they're reopened again, everyone involved in it will be dead. And most of the relations involved from all that will be dead. There'll only be names. We'll be about two generations away from it. And there'll only be a name in a family. That's it. People probably won't even know they're related to them. But you know... There you go again. Take someone you're calling pro-government to actually tell you how pro-government you are by protecting all these people. So, uh, yeah. As I said, real governments were in the... Real patriots were in the GPO doing something. They weren't running up and down Molesworth Street knocking the shit out of women. They weren't up at the customs house Beating people, beating other people across the street. They weren't on O'Connell Bridge running into Republican, um, other Republican protests that were going on. Um, if your government isn't afraid of you, you need to do something to make them take notice of you. But you're not going to do that because you want trouble. That's all you want. You know that. I know that. So if you want to be taken seriously by anyone, Go out, do something. I don't even need to dare you because you're, you're that fucking dumb you won't do it. You need, if you want to take your power back, that you say you need to take back because you can taste it, go out and do something. Do something that will make the government, the Gardaí and everyone else in power take notice. That's all you have to do. Even us on the right. Or on the left, sorry. Let us take notice. Let us look at you and say, right, maybe there's something there. But you're not going to do that. All you want to do is cause trouble. And as regards religion that I'm always speaking out about, a lot of people give out to me because, oh, you're always at the Catholic Church. You know why I'm always at the Catholic Church? Because it's the one I know best. It's the one that took me as a baby indoctrinated me into the religion and then tell me I can't leave that religion no that's not how that fucking shit goes down it's a control system that's all it is if you don't believe that that's completely up to you but don't come harking your shit at me and I'm on about all religions 
All religions are a form of control. All religions have abused children, women and everyone else. And all religions are attached to paedophile rings. Simple as. Now, uh, I think I might have covered everything. But, uh, as per usual, I'll um, see you all in the comment section because uh, I know how shit goes down there and put it this way, it's uh, it's not very good to be down there sometimes, but you gotta do it. Anyway, over and out guys, have a good one.